Uh, hi. I'd like to, you know, search for multi-level pointers in endless space, but since this game stores, you know, I've been unsuccessful, I've followed a tutorial and I've successfully found a base address for civilizations. Five. And in that game, they store values I'll be loading up a prepared game, you know, just to update the pointers and speed things up. I'll I'll look for, you know, I'll execute the multi multi-level pointer search. And first, I'm gonna, you know, demonstrate that it doesn't. It doesn't work on, on endless space, but it works on on Civilizations 5. Okay. That should take care of that. So new value is 40. And I'll just search for increased. I'll just use uh, shortcuts, hotkeys to make things faster. So hopefully this is the research. I'll try and update it to five. I don't know why cheat engine does that. Let's see. Yeah. So five. It I found my research and what the tutorial says I should do is use this option. You know, just scan for things, save my results, I'll save it. Space one. Takes a while to scan through the games. Memory. But it's not that bad. I'm rushing through this through these steps because I know it won't won't find my pointers. I don't know why. Can't be because of this thing. So you would think oh hunky dory, a lot of pointers. But next time I scan for this, I'll load a new game. The my prepared one. Hopefully this will change the pointers. And in this game, our research is currently currently 12. Uh, good luck finding that. I'll go. Like this. Update. Research value. Now it's 43. I'll go increased and change. I'll go and change this value to something. Oh man. I just, you know, select this one. I hit enter and I type the new value, for example, 13. Update it. Yeah, it's 13. So what the tutorials that I found suggest is to copy this address and find it in these uh, results through rescan memory option. So search for address. This one. And I'll save it to two, I guess. But it, it will come up empty. And just to, to show that it works on 4 byte values, I'll go back to civilizations. Whoa. Whoa, this has never happened before. For me, it's always been empty. 
Whoa. Uh, okay, I don't know what to do now. Guess I'll... I don't know. Should I go back to first game? Should I start a new game? I'll try like this. 16 I'll go ahead and find the, the research again Do I need to open the process or not? I can't remember I guess not uh, Like, yeah, 16 40 Okay, so I'll take this address And I'll search through here. Oh, no idea. Okay, okay. Attempt number three. Yeah, so see, it's empty. I don't know why. So, let's go back to... Not, well, I mean... I'll go... To what's it called? Civilization 5 and just just to prove that this approach works on and I found the base address in Civilization 5 research oh, guess I'll just skip through these intros takes a while and Yeah, I should have skipped them. And I'll go to my uh, prepared save games. I got three games prepared. Let's see. So the current research here is 14. Go ahead and open up the process. Um, and since I've got the my previous scans, I'll just load them up, and you can see that it works. Uh, but I'll go ahead and you know I could just scan for it, but. I'll go ahead and add this address manually. It's FD F75 B44. Just to speed things along, you would search manually. Uh, it it will it will you know show multiple results. But just try editing one and in, and in turn and seeing the results uh, and what when you found when you have found the address you just go through the same steps as before but this time you know I know I don't change anything and I'll save this as oh, caps lock yeah so basically we search for pointers and I don't know because Maybe it's because uh, Endless Space and Endless Legend game uses floats and here we search for 4 bytes direct value, maybe that, I don't know what's the issue maybe so somebody smarter than me can clear up the thing help me out oh. 
Okay, so we got this. Um, we got a lot of pointers, so let's go ahead and load a different game. Hopefully, the pointers are updated in the memory. You know, tutorials f from other people on YouTube suggest. To restart the game or restart the computer even but I think loading a new game ju is just you know quite enough so here I've got eight and I think I'll need to I could try searching for eight through here. I never tried this. Sit down. Nothing. So they point to this address and let's see. If I change it to Got four. If I change it to twenty nine, with two zeros, I ah, see. I could have gone through through uh, normal searching, you know, to find the value, but instead I used the pointer results. So now what this t tutorial suggests is to, you know, search for this address to decrease the pointers. No. Can I somehow... Oh, I need to type it out, okay. So... Address... F D F seven five zero zero four. It's correct, yeah. Save it as attempt three. It gave a bit less pointers. I I guess, but not really. But if I try to load the next game, or if, even if I, I'll try restarting after this attempt. Okay, so here the research is 12. So let's see, can we find it through here? Could be this address. Well, let's type it out manually. F D F seven five five zero four. Um, let's change it to twenty nine again. Oh no, twenty nine zero zero. Yeah, so this is our research. Uh, let's go ahead and refine the results again. Copy this number or type it out. Actually, crap, whatever. It's it only decreased by a couple of thousand pointers but basically you whittle whittle down all these pointers until until you find the, the what's it called the static address for research in a sieve so basically whenever you start a new game you know 
just just open sieve uh, just search for anything really you know add something to results and to open this window you know I'll close it to open this window you need to go through here click cancel click file open select your latest results um, and there you have it you know to load to load your previous work and you can continue you know you can't open this window directly so thanks for watching maybe you can help me with endless legend right here endless space and endless legend with these games you know they, they say research as floats and the pointer scanning this wave you know d didn't give me any any results Thanks.